this uh, Bosch jackhammer. I had my reservations on getting this hammer because I thought it was a little bit small. Uh, but after using it, it definitely is uh, a hammer that I like. So it comes with, uh, so basically it comes with this rolling kit, which is really sweet for, compared to most jackhammers. Um, um, this is basically what it comes with. There's a little tube of oil, or uh, oil, I guess that's for putting inside here. A rag, because I know you're going to be dying of sweat. No, I'm just kidding. I'm thinking the rag is for the, uh, the bit up in here. So this is actually the bit that it comes with. Um, it's a point bit. I've only used this one, one time on one job so far, but I've never been a big fan of the pointy, the pointed bits. So I did pick up this chisel bit or this, uh, I think it's like a one inch it's like a standard jackhammer bit. I found that on Amazon for like maybe 30 bucks. And it's always good to have two anyways because sometimes you get one stuck. Like actually I did get this one stuck. And that's why I ended up trying this one out, but I definitely still like this wider chisel bit better. Usually works better. They say that uh, this SDX Mac, SDS Max will fit in there, but it's so small it's no way I would, I would ever use it. But, um, so I've had several jackhammers. I had the Hilti uh, 3000, I think it is, TE 3000, which is a very large machine. One of the things, one of the reasons why I got this one is because it has this extra handle and you can actually, because of the, as you can see from the video, um, I had to do a lot of curves. So sometimes it was easier to hold it sideways. So most jackhammers, a traditional jackhammer, just has like the two T handles and you're you're running it with T handles, but this one has this extra handle here. You can put it any direction you want. Which is nice because when you have the tip, let's put one of these in there. very balanced machine so what I like is so you could hold it like this like a traditional jackhammer or I mean if you're wanting to rest you can even just press with this one hand it still works great or you can you can handle it better you can pick it up chisel on an angle I mean it's definitely more of a lightweight machine than like a 90 pound jackhammer but I was surprised how well it worked we were chipping like eight to 12 inches thick of concrete. It didn't have any rebar in there. So, I mean, I understand it was probably slightly slower, but it's one of those tools that is very simple to keep in the trailer or in the truck because of the kit. And it's just a lighter weight machine. I think it weighs 38 pounds, but the force that it hits, it actually hits faster than like one of the bigger jackhammers. Um, but, I ran it all day yesterday and then for like two hours this morning and I honestly was very happy with it. So I, I was very skeptical because of how small it is, honestly smaller than any jackhammer I've ever had. But um, it did the job and I definitely would recommend it. I'm not getting like paid to say that or anything like that, but I definitely would recommend this machine just for, I mean obviously. It's not gonna do what a 90 pound ear jackhammer is gonna do, but we're like a jackhammer on a bobcat or something. But, but this is uh, definitely a good machine for the money. I think it was about $1,000 maybe, uh, right around $1,000 at Home Depot. Came with one bit, the case, the mighty sweat rag. Still can't figure out the rag. <laughs> Comes with the rag, the Bosch rag. Uh, but yeah, I'd love to hear uh, if you guys have used this and you can leave that in the comments 
Uh, you can subscribe to the channel if you want. I'm trying to get more uh, reviews going on you know, construction tools or even some how-to videos. But um, yeah, let me know if you have any questions. Again, this is the GSH-16. That's the actual model number here. Um, you can see me using it uh, in some of those videos. But um, yeah, that's all I got. Jack Amber's doing pretty good. I'm liking it. It's our third one we've gotten done. Been running this thing on the Champion generator. Here's another one here. Just putting in sidewalks through here. That little hammer is nice. So we got three down. Three more to go.